A two-day-long second Open Nagaland Ping Pong Championship 2022 begins today at K. Kair Indoor Stadium, NAP Training Center, Chumukidima, under the AGs of Northeast India Academy of Performing Arts. Altogether, 42 players are participating in the championship, including both men and women. Besides top Naga players, some renowned players from Assam, Manipur, Mizoram and Arunachal Pradesh are also taking part in the tournament. Zalio Rio, MLA and advisor to Department of Sericulture, Excise and Minority Affairs, graced the program as guest of honor and Rosovoto Chatsu, Village Council Chairman, Chumuki Dima and President Angami Public Organization as the special guest. During the program, advisor Rio also honored the neighboring states' renowned players for their participation. The second Open Nagaland Ping Pong Championship 2022 will conclude on November 29th. In Nagaland, I, if I can recollect, perhaps about 30 years plus, there used to be a lot of uh, enthusiasm for this table tennis discipline. But uh, over the years, gradually, other disciplines have taken over. Badminton is still uh, being pursued by many players and other disciplines. But I am very happy that uh, the Northeast India Academy of Performing Arts, apart from their contribution to our youth in various fields, like uh, even beauty pageant, or even skill training and others. They're also taking up uh, sports, particularly this ping pong discipline. And uh, I hope that through them, through their forum, our this ping pong discipline will be revived. Because as I've said in the past, many of have uh, great enthusiasm for table tennis. But uh, Perhaps somewhere something is falling apart, but I urge open not only this society to take this tournament in a regular manner, but also to have this forum upgraded so that uh, our youths who have potential in ping pong also can uh, get the much needed exposure and will also excel well within our state and also even in the northeastern region and also go on to make a name for us in the national level and beyond that also. So we have uh, participants from Assam, uh, Mizoram, Manipur and Arunachal Pradesh and all together we have 42 participants and we have some top players also with us. Uh, Jeho from Mizoram, he is uh, current India ranking number 8. He's also here. Then we have Segal from Manipur, who is the current um, India ranking number 18. He's also here participating in this tournament. I would like to believe so, that this is one of the biggest tournaments of table tennis in the Northeast because uh, uh, we have almost all the top players. Assam has the first team, Manipur sent their first team, Mizoram sent their first team. So I think this, this will be one of the biggest, one of the biggest table tennis tournaments in Northeast, yeah. Actually, we're not into sports, but we saw that uh, TT hasn't been getting enough attention. So that's the reason we, me and my friends, we thought we'll try and do something for this, for sports. So we chose table tennis since there's a lot of people who are not so into table tennis. So we got into it. We did the last year's edition and this year we thought we'll continue with it. And that's how this tournament came to be. Our Naga table tennis players, like I said, we do not get much exposure, so we don't get enough opportunity to go out and compete with the other players of India. So when you talk about a tournament like this, we have Jeho, we have Segal, we have uh, the first team of Assam, we have the first team of Manipur. So this is a golden opportunity, I feel, for Naga players because no matter where they play, like, I mean, even if they go for nationals, which is very rare for us Nagas, so... Even if we go, we do not, we are not assured that we'll meet players of this caliber. But now in a tournament like this, in our um, state, all these players are here, there's like 50-50 chance that you might meet them. So I think this is a golden opportunity. You've been practicing the whole year and suddenly you can at least try what you've practiced, see where you stand with players like this. This is the first time I came to Nagaland and, you know, I would like to experience how's Nagaland and the land and the people and, 
Here the organizers are welcoming me uh, with a warm welcome and it's very good for us. It's a healthy for us and you know, I would like to play here, uh, play the tournament because uh, it will be the first time coming to Nagaland and uh, I want to show the players how they are playing and and I think yeah, in the future I think they can play well because the organizers are helping them very well and yeah, I think they will play well. Uh, I was staying in Croatia for three months. And this week I came back to India and after a long journey I, went, I was in the hospital for one night and maybe I'm not in, not in a good form in this tournament so I think it will be a tough fight. What message you would like to give to the other players especially for Nagaland uh, player? I would like to tell them that they should never quit when they lose. Uh, when we lose uh, it's not that we lose, it's l we are learning. So we have to keep that in mind and moving forward. Thank you. Thank you so much.